once again welcome to Adiotech. i'm delighted to have you back on my channel in today's tutorial, i'm going to talk about casting in python basically what is casting casting allows you to specify the type of variable so let's say we have an integer variable and then we want any input the user they're going to enter into our system to be an integer we can use the casting to do that if you want to convert a value into a floating a, flo a floating point value we we'll use the floating point to cast it we can also use the string and all that so this will be so this will allow you to get a specific variable type when you try it, when you cast this using the casting as we're going to do in this particular short tutorial remember to stay tuned and hit the like button if you enjoyed this tutorial so let's say for instance we have a number so first i'm going to start with integer so you want to cast a value into an integer how to do it so let's see integer I want to cast a value into an integer so what i'm going to do is that i'm going to say num is called to what 2.7 in reality this is a floating point value this is a floating point value but maybe i want to convert into an integer so you know integer does not have a decimal place so i want it to be a whole number so that's an integer so in order to get this value into an integer all i need to do is that i need to go ahead and say print and within this my print statement i need to enforce the integer on this so this is how we call the casting so now i'm going to call this number the number here will be enforced into what an integer so this is a variable i've created to store the 2.7 and this time around to print out this i want it to be an integer value so i'm going to enforce this so if i go ahead to run this code you can see it's giving me two and then ignoring what the 0.7 so this is casting this enables me to be able to enforce my output to be what just a whole number so that is casting it helps a lot and most of my program if you take note what i do is that let's say i have a number that's a variable and i want to accept input from a user let's say input and i want the user to enter the age i want to accept accept the age of the user let's say enter your age so this is what i want the user may go ahead and enter a number which is not a whole number so what i do is that to enforce this when close all this and then i'll bring in the integer over here so i'll cast this i'll use the casting keyword that is the integer so i want to make sure that whatever the user is going to enter is an integer and then i'll store it within this variable integer so I use this a lot in most of my program to make sure that the value I'm receiving or the variable I'm receiving from the person is an integer variable. So I use this a lot and casting will help you to get the right data type you want. So this is an integer. If I go ahead and then 2.000 whatever and I try to run this code, I'm still going to get two because it's going to force this. And no matter what you type, this is still going to be printed out as two because we are using the integer keyword let's go ahead and see how the floating one will be so this is i'm going to comment this out in python to comment i'll just use the hash keyword before that so i'll take this one out and let's come here and then try the floating so let's say float we want to do this and let's create another number so let's say number and then let's assign this number to let's say three this is an integer but let's say you want to accept this is this one in the decimal format this is where we have to also cast by using the float keyword so i'll say print i'll say print and this time i'll say float okay and then we'll bring our number here this is our variable sto storing the number three remember to subscribe to this channel and don't forget to hit the like button if you enjoyed this tutorial also remember to turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any of my upcoming video so what is going to happen is if i print out there it's going to give me 3.0 because well, this is an integer but i want to force it into a floating point which is which means that it's going to be a decimal value so if i run this see we are getting 3.10 okay so this is how the floating point also works so we cast this number though it's an integer but we want our final result to be what a floating point so that is casting okay so it will help us a lot if it's an integer we can equally do the same thing let me just come down here and then i'm still going to comment this out commenting this out and then when i come down here so this will give us the 3.0 
we also have other option where you can cast using a string you can use a string to cast your value so let's say we have a name so let's say we have a name so let me go and say to use casting let's say we want to use a string let's this is all we're going to do so let's say we let me comment first comment this out comment this out and on a string i'll say have a name and let's say the name is coffee and i want to print this out so see and i'll bring my str this way and then i'll bring my name so this is basically a string and we expect it as it to be but we just want to make sure that our input input that we want to specify is a string okay so we use casting to be able to get a type of data remember to subscribe if you enjoyed this short tutorial i'm going to have several things coming your way in this particular channel i'll be teaching so many tricks and top python lesson and other programming language you would like for beginners so remember to subscribe so you don't miss any of this tutorial stay tuned for my next video tutorial in python till i come away another time bye bye